Hi everybody and welcome back to episode 24. Sorry about the previous video, the, my game crashed and I never actually recovered, which I find quite weird. But unfortunately it did. And I also had a bit of a server rollback, so it didn't save. I'm going to save now quickly. So I recrafted the cultivator and the pick. Let's hope it doesn't crash. I actually do not need that in my quick bar. And I do believe I can craft the bow as well. Yeah, I can craft the fine wood bow. So I'm just going to get the resources for that. I'm a little bit weighted. Uh, and we'll be put, putting our wood there. So we don't need the full stack. We just need... Put that one away. So let's improve our bow. Um, let's put that in there so we're not carrying excess stuff. And we just need the hide, which I'll put over here. So now we've got a better bow. We can upgrade it. And we can go again. Nice. So we put our spare bow in there. Put him in slot there. And I should actually have enough uh, bronze to make this as well. Yes, I do. Uh, but now put all the wood away. So let's go put this wood away. Change it out for the normal wood. Okay, we also need to go here. Ah, I haven't labeled these properly. That is birch wood. That's normal wood. I brought my carrot seeds, but I didn't bring my other seeds. Well done, Edges. Well done. Okay. Now we we'll just grab some more copper. Make the buckler. Let's upgrade the buckler. A bit more bronze, and we do have so might as well just use it. Yeah, so we're fully upgraded to where we can upgrade for the moment. Let's sort all this stuff out. Okay, that can go in there, that can go in there. I can plant trees right now. And I think we're putting our resin in that storage. Yep. We put that there. So now we're a lot stronger than what we were. For the moment, let's cultivate this land here. Okay, and we've got the cultivator, so we just go there, make it a vegetable patch. Boom. And 
we plant ourselves some carrots. If memory serves, they take like three Valheim days to grow. Uh, I've still got some more seeds. There we go. But yeah, I feel like such a silly billy by not getting that forward before it's like we've been at so many times into the black forest but we've never bothered to get the wood and this little guy is actually defending my base okay so now we need to go and get us a lot of berries Come on, face me. I want someone. Did he really chase the neck instead of me? Okay, so we need to get a lot of berries, both red and blue, to make jam jars, which will give us a good source of health. And uh, stem. And you see these little boars running around here? They're going to turn to jerky. Yeah. You're going to turn into jerky, buddy. Unfortunately, I can't use deer meat for it, but boar meat works. Didn't even see that one. But I saw your friend, thanks to you. Hope you feel bad. See, this bar is actually more accurate and it hits harder. I do need to get rid of my cooked meat. I can still cook the, the deer meat, but. For the moment, I need boar meat. So this should probably be a good time to tame me up some boars. See, so I need a lot of these. And pity I can't like, grow with my own bush. For those that are interested, there is a dev command that will allow you to place them. But, yeah, we aren't cheating here. This is a no portal run, so you can imagine no cheating is allowed. So there's no portals, there's no thingy. I don't like those. I don't need more of that. You can throw that away too. <coughs> I do need to farm feathers as well at some point. See all this nice core wood. This should be a mound, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's a... Let's see if it's a troll cave or a burial mound. Troll cave. Hello, anybody home? Oh, and he's stuck. I'm perfectly... Oh.
It's one of those situations. You do not try this at home. Okay. He's clearly beating me. But I messed it up there. I will be honest, I messed it up. Okay. Let's mark him. Troll cave. So we're looking for some blueberries, that's why we came here. We also need the thistles. Also pity I can't grow those. I want to mark this copper note, because I came in here... Oopsie. Came in here the other day looking for copper. So we've got a copper deposit right there. Okay, throw that out. I'm finding lots of thistles, but I'm not finding the blueberries. I saw someone walking here. We are quite close to a base though. Uh, it's only... Is that your friend, the deer? No, I still got both deer. You know, if you smash these, you actually get quite a bit of nice stuff in the barrels. Okay, there should be a chest of some kind here. Oh, there it is. No, I want that. Put that in there. I guess now I can't get out. Well done, game. Well done. Okay, we're still looking for blueberries. Throw that away. The other forests have plenty of blueberries. Some nice thistles. So, see, I need the thistles for the. Oh, there's some blueberries there. The more advanced recipes. Uh, I just want to mark the spot here. Blueberries. So I don't have to go looking for it. I know exactly where it is. Next time. And I'm just going to not fight next to it because obviously I want the blueberries to respawn and not destroy it. That's the side of the forest I haven't been yet. Like, I ran through here and I was like, nope, it is dangerous. Oh, it's getting intense. But at least I managed to get the better, the better pick, which will make my life easier. Okay, that's the end of the forest.
So it's just this border here. There's a deer. You'll notice that this new bow of mine is like way better. The other one had like this weird drop off range. This one also has the drop off range, but it's not as punishing. I want to say. Okay, so we got three blueberries, but that's not nowhere near enough. We need way more. Same with the thistles. How's that for our priorities? I'm more interested in the thistles than I'm in the skins. Uh, I knew someone was shooting arrows at me. Very fun, that's the ones that came out when I ran through you the other day. Uh, berry bush. Blueberry. Now we've got five, but we've got 21 red. Uh. See, here's a nice, oh wait. That's why it's a nice flat stone. It's a crypt. Normal berry. Uh, I'm going backwards by the looks of things. <laughs> Got him. Even if I haven't tried. Copper. Yeah, I'm marking all this because I need to come in and out here and farm properly. And now I'm like pretty much at the end of the copper a copper age. So we're forty and nasty. But I want to have more than what I need. <laughs> oh, it's getting dark. Am I stuck in some weird little canal? Something red there. Ah, uh, it's one of those notice signs. Probably will take me to an elder's base here. Seriously, since when did it take me three hits to kill a guy? Oh, yeah, it is night time, so. Oh, and we've got a brute. I'm just trying to get my stam up, and then it's game on. Come on. I want to click on that sign that he's guarding. Hopefully this will tell me that there's an elder nearby. <laughs> That's nowhere near where I am. <laughs> Oops, didn't mean to ping. Okay, there's another thingy. Anything good? Some hide. Some coal. Lots more coal. Nice. 
nice berry patch here. Okay, I don't want to fight on the berry patch. Come to me. And now with all this extra stuff I'm picking up, it's making me weighted. Okay, nothing's attacking me. No. Blueberry. Yeah, I'm particularly looking for the ones close to my base because I don't really want to go out big long distances looking for stuff. Let's just be close by. Okay. Now we turned around. Uh, might as well. I'm fully loaded. Let's head home. We we'll make some jam jars and some jerky. So much carrot seeds here. Okay, so now I'm back in the meadows. Oh, there's a boar. And a big shaman. Show the shaman who's boss, didn't they? Hey, no pushy. Uh, well, I don't want that stuff. Anything but that. Oh, I'll take the seeds. Oh, carrying too much. Uh, I'm on slot cap again. I need that better belt. I make my life so much easier. Also, there's new gear that I've crafted for myself. Yes, I know I crafted it, but it's also slightly more heavier. I'm not carrying neck meat, am I? No, I'm not. Dear, you get to live another day. Mostly because I'm full. Dear guys, thanks for watching. We made some good progress. The thing is, I need lots of stone. I do really need lots of wood. That's why I'm putting them in the carts over here. Okay, let's rest up. quickly save our game because of what happened just now I don't want this to happen again take the raw meat uh, more honey Did 
I lose something? Because I didn't offload. Oh, and I offloaded all the wood. <laughs> Trying to work out like, why suddenly I'm so much lighter. <laughs> Blueberry. So we go here to the cauldron. See, this is why I like the half wall, but the half wall wasn't working. Use cauldron. I can make jerky. And you'll notice that for every one that you make, you actually get two back, which is a nice exchange. And it's the same as with the Queen's Jam. We'll look at that recipe in a moment. Just want to finish crafting this. Okay, we've got tasty meat, lowers health regeneration but increases stamina. We don't want that. Let's look at the Queen's Gem. You get 8 for 6. I didn't realize it was such a bad conversion, but I, I craft 2 and I've got 8 gems. So, what we're going to do is we're going to put that in there. Put the blueberries in that in there. Uh, we've got one labeled cooked, so we put that in there. I want to finish that off. And we're also going to put our lentils in there, uh, which is the one that has, requires the lentils. See, it's uh, resistant to poison, that's why I want it. And then you also get the healing one. That's why going out and getting those blueberries and why I mark them is so important. My carrots are healthy, so they're happy with me. And I just put the carrot seeds in there. Put my excess feathers in there. That's the see that's the heads. Put that in there. I'm going to use that first, and I'm also going to use the cooked uh, deer meat. Mostly because I don't need to don't need to keep cooked anymore. One of these has my gold in it, I hope. Or oh, my gold's still at the other base. Nope, my gold's still at the other base. But I ain't gonna go fetch it. Let's put this there for now. We do need the dandelions here. And it's already like halved our weight, as you can see. I don't always need to carry the cultivator with me. It's only for when we need it. Uh, the hoe I do need regularly. But let's get us some more boars. And apparently we need lots of more berries as well. Didn't quite realize it was such a bad conversion. But it's nice to have, if you know what I mean. They last longer, they... So we must always be collecting berries. I want to have a quick peek to see if this is a Draga spawn. Because if this is a Draga spawn, oh, I'll be so lucky.
Like the reason why I say I'll be lucky if this is a Drago spawn. You can farm sausages here. Oh, it is a Drago spawn. And they actually hit quite hard, so. Let's kill these two that have I've triggered. See, they'll give entrails. And their entrails can be converted into sausages. Now I just need to find out which house is actually, oh, he's up there. See, even the Drago are clever, they've got little hideaways. Okay, they're not too interested in me. I'm fine with that. Oh, that's what happened. Rude. But yeah, you can convert their, their entrails to sausages. Which is another nice food to have. And having that spawn right there. Oh, I am so lucky. Because like normally you would need to go into the swamp to farm them, right? So I've got a plane. A plane's biome. So I can grow the plane's food. I've got the normal berries and everything else here in the normal biome. And I've got a drago spawn right here. This is, it's not quite the perfect base because if I want to say it's perfect, I need a miss spawn. Like having all three or four spawns right here. Oh, that would be like heaven for me. But hey, this is about as close to perfect as I'm going to get. And it wasn't even planned. That's like the best part. The, pl the, pl the planes was planned. The planes on a meadow border. But having a Drago spawn right there. Oh, nice. Okay, I'm actually heading back to base. I'm going to call the video here. And you I will see you guys in the next episode. Uh, just a heads up, if you are enjoying these videos that I'm busy uploading, please feel free to subscribe and like and comment on the videos. It's hitting that thumbs up is, costs you guys nothing, but it helps me a lot with regards to promoting my channel. So please definitely hit that thumbs up. If you want to comment and chat with me, even better. And thank you so much. I shall see you guys in the next video.